Hi, my name is Riley Rodericks. I'm a physical therapist at iPal Physical Therapy. You have received your Squid Go ankle system, and I'd like to take a moment to show you how to set up the system to get the most out of your treatments. Let's get started. In the box, you will receive a Squid Go control unit with a charger and a connector tube. You will also receive an ankle wrap and an ankle gel pack, as well as a user manual and a quick start guide. Please be sure to read the manual and refer to the quick start guide before use. Before using the Squid Go for the first time, you will need to charge the control unit using the provided charger. Let the unit charge for about 8 hours or overnight. Before using the gel pack for the first time, place it in the freezer overnight. After the initial treatment, place the gel pack back in the freezer for one hour between treatments. Once the control unit is fully charged and the gel pack is frozen, you're ready to get started. Setup is quick and easy. Attach the gel pack inside the wrap using the Velcro tabs. Place your foot wearing a sock in the center of the wrap with the riding on the right side of the foot and the heel at the back edge of the wrap. If possible, keep your knee and ankle aligned at right angles. Pull the straps on each side of your foot and up towards the knee. Wrap the strap with the Squid Go logo around your shin and fasten. Fasten the back strap around your calf. Connect the foot straps across the top of your foot and adjust the wrap to fit snugly around your foot. Attach the connector tube to the pump and wrap. Turn on the Squid Go control unit. Select compression level by using the white dot. Start treatment by long press on the start button. Full treatment lasts 15 minutes. You can see the treatment progression on the display. The unit will turn off automatically at the end of the treatment. When finished, remove the wrap and place the gel pack in the freezer.